now we're gonna take the tram. <laughs> We spent the day walking around and exploring Edinburgh City Centre in Old Town. We went into a cute secondhand bookshop called Armchair Books, and my dad got another Scottish tattoo. We then headed to the castle and stopped in a few souvenir shops and ended up on the prettiest street in Edinburgh, the Royal Mile. Carson's run into the stores that are Harry Potter themed. From one Harry Potter store to the next? Yeah. We stopped at the iconic Grey Friars Bobby statue, which is a statue dedicated to the Sky Terrier who sat at his owner's grave for 14 years until he passed away. So, of course, we booped him on the nose and told him he was a good boy. This free interactive map. Harry Potter fans flock to the Kirkyard to play homage to one of the most famous villains in modern children's literature, Tom Riddle, and visit the graves of Moody, Potter, and McGonagall. She just got the ideas for their names. The view is pretty crazy out here. I still haven't watched Harry Potter. You're a poser, Blake. I'm a We're gonna try to hike up it. It's definitely steeper than it looks. Yep, the harder way. We made it to the top, well halfway to the top. We have to turn back because our family is sitting down at the bottom. But we are so glad we mustered up the energy to hike up here because it is breathtaking. We, we should do this more often, go to Scotland and do this. Really pretty. It looks so and pretty. you can see the ocean back. Yeah. Like, look at that. Like, look it's at that. Really like, I might say this is prettier than Santorini. What? Yeah.